Joining me now from our virtual room is CNN's Tom Foreman. And Tom, you've been able to lay out the scene. Uh, tell us about this attack. Yeah, if you look at the map, Jake, it gives you an idea of why this was so deadly. Here's the Vegas Strip that so many people know, running right through the middle of everything. The concert venue is right over here on the east side, Mandalay Bay over here, and this is the room from whence this man was firing. So what he had was a really overreaching view of the entire venue over here, about 400 yards away, all easily within range of his weapons. Now, over that sort of distance, the weapons he had, the, the, what we know about them so far, he probably would have seen each bullet drop two to four feet, somewhere in there below where he was aiming, but that didn't matter. You heard all that rapid fire there? That rapid fire was being directed right toward the bulk of the people right in front of the stage like this. So it was simply a sweeping gunfire where there was no way for people to get out of the way. That's the first reason that this was such a deadly attack. Lots of people in a compact area that he could fire into. The second reason that this was such a deadly attack is fairly simple. There were seven official exits to this concert area. The four on the side near me were also the entrances. We've heard eyewitnesses talk all day about people trying to go back out the way they came in. Psychologically, most people do this at times like this, so they were actually moving toward the gunman, not away from him, even those who tried to flee. And the last part of this, why the, the fatalities and the injuries mounted so much, is also the fact that many people did not know where this gunfire was coming from. Your last guest said she knew it was coming from above, but a lot of other people all day have talked about saying we just didn't know which direction it was coming from. You watch the videos, you see people looking all sorts of directions, and ultimately, many of them hunkering down where they were, trying to be safe, even as she said, get down, he won't be able to shoot you, unaware that the whole time the gunman could see all of them out there, Jake. Those are three reasons why this attack went on so long and so many people were killed and hurt.